Hi, today I will show you how to install the Trojan battery charge indicator for our GC248 volt lithium ion batteries. Our indicator monitors the battery system's state of charge and alerts you to possible battery issues. Please be aware that our indicator requires battery to battery communication cables. They will need to be purchased separately from an authorized Trojan dealer. For a two battery setup, you will need one cable. For three batteries, you will need two. Now let's get started. First, Create a safe work environment. Review all product warning labels and Trojan GC248 volt lithium ion user's guide. Remove nearby items that can create sparks, flames, and static electricity. Remove any jewelry or other personal conductive objects. Put on safety glasses and gloves. Next, unpack the box and remove the following items. Quick start guide. Battery charge indicator. Mounting bracket and hardware. Power and communications harness adapter cable, connector terminator cap, and don't forget to purchase your COM port cables. Switch your vehicle from run mode to tow mode. Turn off all batteries by pressing and holding the status button. After all lights power down, wait two seconds, then release the status button. Verify the batteries are powered off by quickly pressing the status button. If OK status light doesn't flash green, the car is now ready to have the battery charge indicator installed. You'll need a two inch hole in the dashboard to properly install the battery charge indicator. Insert and secure the unit to the backside of the dash with included mounting bracket and hardware. Next, carefully attach the power and communications harness to the back of the indicator. The harness consists of a COM port connector and positive and negative wires. Now, Connect the gauge's negative wire to the main negative terminal of any battery, which will be labeled first in the string. The positive red wire with a replaceable fuse will be connected to the key switch. Connect it to the output switch that has power when the key is in the on position. Please be aware, some models may require a connection to the positive post on the solenoid. The last step is to install the battery to battery communication cables. To start the string, connect the indicator's COM port cable to any battery COM port. Continue to the next battery COM port until only one port is available. Install the connection termination cap to the last open COM port in the string. Next, turn on each battery by pressing and holding the status button for two to three seconds after OK status light is on. Switch your vehicle from tow mode to run mode. Turn on the key switch. The indicator will display the number of total batteries connected. That number should reflect the number of lithium ion batteries in your vehicle. If it does not, ensure the batteries are turned on and all cables are securely connected. The gauge should now display current voltage level, state of charge, battery capacity, and amp draw. Verify the battery charge indicator powers off when the key is switched to off. Thank you for joining us today. If you need more information, please contact Trojan Technical Support or visit our website.